Module 14 on movement. Using the accelerometer, you can program the micro bit to look for specific actions. For example, you can tell if it's upside down, moving, etc. Instead of making you program these individually, the micro bit has some of them already programmed into it that you can use. To access these, click on the input menu and then choose the on shake block. This is a container block, so it's always checking if the movement occurs, and when it does, the blocks inside it will run. There are 11 built-in movements. The first eight describe what they are, for example, shake, tilt right, etc. Free fall is if you drop it, so it's moving down the z-axis very fast. The last three are all about g-force, like the force that Air Force pilots feel when they accelerate really quickly. There are three levels. 3G detects the smallest sudden change, whilst 8G needs a much more sudden change. These could, for example, identify if the micro bit was moving and has suddenly come to a stop, for example, by hitting something. In this first example, the container block is continually checking whether the micro bit is being shaken. If it is, then it will output the current temperature. The second one is checking to see whether a g-force of 8g has been experienced. As soon as it has, the microbit will output, ouch, that hurt.